actually all right. I can see the summit. I can see the summit of the Tetons. We should have never thought that we could climb a, a mountain like this. We should have prepared more. Let's go. We're almost there. Almost there. Oh. Whoa. Oh. Oh. I wish oh. I had the proper footwear. Josh Miner, it's a pleasure to meet you. Oh, Pencil, <laughs> it is so great to have you here. Oh my gosh, we are so happy to have you as our chief climbing instructor at oh. Outward Bound. Well, I'm so happy to be here. <laughs> okay. Hi, I'm Paul Petzl. I'm the lead climbing instructor of Outward Bound, and today we're going to show you how to tie in with a rope so that you can do fun activities like rock climbing and feel safe. So, here we take the rope here, we're going to make an X, and then we're going to go through our belly button right here, up, upper belly button, and you're going to form a bracelet around your wrist, and then you're going to take this rope, and you're going to go underneath, underneath the rope, and then you're going to grab it on the other side and bring it through the bracelet. And this is called a bowling knot. Oh, wow. Okay, can I try? Yeah, of course. Wow. Well, she's <laughs> eager. <laughs> From my experience at Outward Bound, I found that even the, even the instructors need help when it comes to teaching. So that's why I opened Knowles, the National Outdoor Leadership School. It's such an honor to be here. Here. We got the grant? It's great. All right. All right. I'll be in contact. Thank you. We're coming. We got the grant to hire uh, teachers into our school. Out yeah. of our bounds there? Yeah! Woo! Wait, so who do we call? Hey man, it's Jerry Pye. Good to see ya. Yeah. No, we just got a grant um for to hire outward bound teachers into our uh, staff. Are you interested? Yeah, we'd be giving you the position as director. Hi, I'm Bob Lentz. I'd like to welcome the students here at Hamilton Wyndham High School to Project Adventure. My colleague here, Carl Ronke, and I have incorporated outward bound practices into your high school curriculum. And here today, she's going to take you through one of our initiatives called the Trust Ball. All right, guys. So today we're going to do some, we're going to start with some Trust Balls, all right? So can I have, um, oh, do you want to help me I'd love demonstrate? To. I'd love to. Okay. So all we're going to do is, when I say go, you're going to start from a little bit further back. Not too far, but just a little bit further back. And whoever is behind is going to be the spotter. So you want to have a nice, firm pose. See what I'm doing? And when I say go, he's just going to fall back. And I'm going to catch him gently. Are you ready? I am. All right. Ready, set, whenever you're ready, go. Just like that. <laughs> and then you're going to let him back up. Are you all ready? We'll all start, right. with the, right. start with the easy uh, ones. Okay. Are we ready? I don't feel comfortable with this. Oh, oh come on. It's easy. You don't feel comfortable? Uh, really? Watch, watch. We'll do it. It's so easy. Actually, you know, Braxton, I feel you. I'm with you. Challenge by choice. Hi there. I'm 
Rocky, and here at Project Adventure, we're going to be doing a team building exercise called Chasing Tails. This stinks. I don't like these people. Uh, Paul Pitzel came to my class at uh, University of New Hampshire years ago for the master's program and he told us this little story or this saying. He said, you know, there's a lot of folks out there that tell you they got 20 years of experience in the outdoors and that's horse shit. They got two years of experience and 18 years of repeating the same mistakes. <laughs>